Hi everybody, welcome back. Let's get started with our warm up. Welcome to music. Can you clap for me? Welcome to music. Can you pat for me? Welcome to music. Can you sing hello? Welcome to music. Can you clap for me? Welcome to music. Can you pat for me? Welcome to music. Can you sing? All right, guys, you know what time it is. Let's go over the rules. Follow all directions. Follow all directions. Raise your hand to be called on. Raise your hand to be called. Respect yourself and others. Respect yourself and others. Treat instruments with care. Treat instruments with care. Everybody. Today I'm going to play the drum in two different ways. I want you to tell me what the difference is. Here's the first way. Here's the second way. First way. Second way. Could you tell me what the difference was? I'll let you think for a moment. Could you guess what the difference was? If you guessed it was the speed, then you're absolutely right. My first time playing the rhythm, it was fast. And my second time playing the rhythm, it was slow. So example number one was fast, while example number two was slow. Boys and girls, in music, when we talk about fast and slow, we have a special word for that. And that word is tempo. T-E-M-P-O, tempo. The tempo is the speed of the music, and I would like us to practice experiencing tempo by moving. I want everyone to stand up, put your elephant trunks together, and when we go slowly, I want you to move your elephant trunks slowly, and when the song goes fast, I want you to move your hands like this, or if you can, stand up. And, and run in place. Ask your parents if, if it's okay if you run in place, okay? But for slowly, you're gonna move your trunks like this. And for fast, you're gonna run in place. Here we go, the elephant song. The elephant moves very slow. doesn't like to move too fast because he is so big and heavy but should he see a tiger or spy a mean old hunter he will start to run and shake the ground and make them all fall down. Rumble, 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 hear the jungle rumble. Rumble, 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 
Hear the jungle rumble, trees shake and sway as the birdies fly away. Lions run and hide with their babies by their side. Rumble, 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 hear the jungle rumble. 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 The elephant moves very slowly, oh so very slowly. He doesn't like to move too fast, because he is so big and heavy. was fun. And now that we're finished the elephant song, I want you to think about two things. I want you to think about how you feel when you hear fast music. So in this song, how did you feel when uh, the elephant was running, when you ran in place? And they said, rumble, 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 hear the jungle rumble. I also want you to think about how you felt when the song was slow. What feelings did you have when they said, the elephant moves very slow? Oh, so very slowly. How did that make you feel? You see, sometimes music can be fast and other times it can be slow. One isn't necessarily better than the other, but they're different in very special ways. Let's try something. I'm going to name a situation and I want you to tell me if you'd rather hear fast music or slow music during that time, okay? Here we go, example number one. When it's time for you to go to bed, do you want to hear fast music or slow music? Okay, okay, okay. How about this? When you are going to a party with your friends, do you want to hear fast music or slow music? Hmm? Okay, okay, okay. You see, fast and slow music have different purposes. Today, I want you to listen to some music and decide if you think the music is fast or slow. And don't forget, when we talk about fast and slow in, in music, the word is tempo. Everybody say it with me. Tempo! Good job. All right, guys, uh, let's stand up and get ready to march like we normally would at the end of our class. Here we go and march.